Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Tackle Warehouse vlog. This week we got a little something different again. Uh, so Corey and I travel throughout the country to meet up with the pros and film on some of the best lakes. And so we started getting smart and finally booked ourselves an extra day or two to actually fun fish after watching the pros jack them. <laughs> and so this last trip with Cody Meyer, one of our Tackle Warehouse pros, we, uh, we were up at Lake of the Pines, which is his home lake in Northern California. And we, we decided to put a little wager on it and do a bingo, bango, bongo tournament, which uh, Corey will explain exactly what that is. So bingo, bango, bongo was something that my grandfather did for me and my brother when we were kids playing golf just to kind of make it a little fun. And I think each person, each bet was 20, a quarter or something like that. But we decided to adapt it for what we were doing here. And so bingo was whoever caught the first fish and made a $20 wager on that, or $20 a piece, so winner got 60 bucks. Uh, and then bango was most fish. And uh, I think it was Daniel's idea for the wager on that one. <laughs> but uh, it was loser of that one had to jump in the lake. Now mind you, we filmed this in December. So it's, you know, 40 something degrees in the morning. The warmest of water ever got was 51 degrees. So uh, it, was, it was cold. That was just between you and I. We figured Cody would kick our butts. So we left him out of the most fish. So loser between us two, got to jump in the lake. Uh, bongo was big fish, and for that one, we had what we did was uh, we filled this in December, like I said. So at the time, the new Tattoo 150 was a classic release reel, and that was when we were both kind of drooling over. So we said whoever wins that between all three of us uh, would get uh, 150. So there we go, the rules are laid down. This is a little bit longer of a video, but there's plenty of funny moments in there. <laughs> so you guys check it out, enjoy. All right, bingo, bingo, bongo. Oh, what is this? What is this? You reel it in to get out of the way. Dude, I was literally reeled it in. <laughs> Bingo! Bingo! <laughs> Are we going to roost this now or what? <laughs> Took off for a minute. I'm just waiting to see who picks up the Ocho first. I'm, I'm getting pretty close, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> hey, it's not a big one, but it's still fun though. <laughs> Ocho finger. Ocho finger strikes again. Uh oh! Biggin'. Ocho. Ocho. Burr. Yeah, let's not talk about cold water. Hey, I would not want to jump in right now. Daniel, there's still time, man. Time for what? Time to put that Ocho on. That's a nice one, huh? Well, good thing you weren't in on this action. We'd be in trouble right now. <laughs> so I've been throwing this wacky rig, nail-weighted Ocho here for a little bit. Neko rig, I guess you call it not getting them. Uh, what am I doing wrong? How are you, how are you fishing it? So, you do exactly like what you just did. <laughs> yeah, it's a big one, huh? Yeah, Uh-oh, Daniel. You better get that out show on, man. <laughs> right now, if you get this in, you got bongo too, man. <laughs> Hey, that could be the tattoo of the 150 at the end of the day. Nice. Nice, dude. That's a fatty. That's chunky. Yeah, so what you're saying, man, that's how you fish the Ocho. <laughs> <laughs> you want me to tell Daniel how to do it? I'm gonna ask no, let's not, da let's not Daniel in on this one. He can just kind of keep doing what he's doing. <laughs> that thing's been feeding up. You keep so. it or just eyeball it? How big do you think it is? Dude, keep it. You can get some photos later, too. Okay. Daniel's like, give me that Ocho. I remember the year we did the polar bear challenge when my you know, brother went to camp. We figured we'll jump it in the water every day and go in the lake and basically take it a shower. And there's no point having to change our underwear either. So we went the whole camp without changing our underwear for six days. Well, 
Put it this way. You wouldn't want to hang those up on the mantle and smell them. <laughs> I tried to challenge Daniel to smell my uh, Sims renewable. He doesn't believe me how absent they are with the uh, antimicrobial. How does the rotation work if I catch a fish back here now? And you get the new back up front. Back and forth. So, yeah. Fish, fish, fish. I might just stay back here for a while and make it fair to be on this. First cast out deep. Oh, that's no, it's <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I if I wanted to reel it. <laughs> going deep, deep. Oh, the daddy finger on me. What's water temp right now? 50.54. We went from like the last fish catch, like bundled up. Uh oh. What do you got, Corey? Whoa. Dude, double up. <laughs> Get one, Daniel. This is an Ocho Fest. Big one, Corey? Dude, look at that down there on the, on the Garmin. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, dude. <laughs> You might have bongo. Oh, look at that. Look at that thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Possible bongo. I don't know, bro. Uh-oh. Oh, no, that might eat yours from breakfast. Oh, dude. He's got weight, though. Look at this. Look at this. Double up. <coughs> Oh no, this is gonna be scary. <laughs> Hi, Blogger, oh. Twinsies? <laughs> wow, dude. Oh, they're like the same size. <laughs> Look nice, at that. <laughs> Choke. Look at that. I think yours is bigger. What do you think? Yeah, a little bit. I, I'll take that. Well, dang it. That's a pretty epic double up though, yeah, huh? Yeah, that's pretty solid. <laughs> that was as good as you're gonna get there. Yeah. All right. You want me to get it, Corey? Yeah, yeah it's, yours is bigger. Not by much, but it's bigger. That was dope. <laughs> yeah, dude. Reset the cameras. <laughs> All right, Daniel, you're down too. I'm getting a little nervous. How are you? Okay, you break one off and Corey puts down the dagger on you. Key to bingo bango bongo is capitalizing on the other mistake. Dude, it's only two fish. Thank God it's not sized right now. Well, I, I think anything over four pounds counts as two, right? <laughs> well, let's see, what's the water temp? It hits 51, that happened. It's 50.74. Hey, Daniel, you could literally two casts in a row and catch one. Just can't break them off. He could also brick a gold too. So. <laughs> We're gonna have to get like a sensor out, man, when you jump in or what? Or is Corey still going? I remember as a kid, not a kid, but when I first started dating my wife, we had a float tube and we were taking a DD-22 and my brother-in-law used to live right over there and we launched out of that little park right there. And I'd just like long line a DD-22 through this whole thing on a float tube, crush them. <laughs> Daniel, you getting nervous or what? I was <clears throat> for a minute, but I'm starting to settle down now. <laughs> you shaking a little too fast? <laughs> I can so much jumping in. Right now it sounds pretty good. Would you do it? Yeah. That's how you got in. Dude, I'm <laughs> man. Like I don't swim until it's 80 degrees. Uh oh. Uh oh. What do you got? Small well, yeah. guy. Doesn't matter. Just gotta get in the boat still, though. You get that thing in, and it counts as a fish. Uh oh! Oh no! Uh oh! Uh oh! It's gonna break off. It's done. Oh, right now it's two zip, Corey. Isn't that that metal cage on this right here? Oh! Get! I got it! Oh, I got it! <laughs> Oh, man. Woo!
I was starting to get nervous. <laughs> there was some shrinkage, pre-shrinkage going on. <laughs> nice. I think I'm right under the boat too. I'll take I'll take that, Jack. <laughs> you guys start the cameras first. You guys start the cameras. <laughs> make some transfers out of you. Why do they keep doing? What am I doing? Look at him's falling apart already. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's starting to crumble. He had a comfortable lead. I prefer to come from behind. So when are we going till? When's this battle gonna end? When we both tap out. And when it gets close, and we just say one hour to go or something. Or someone going in after the sun goes down. Yeah, I see how that tree's leaning like that. Uh oh. What is under the boat? Uh oh. Another Dude, are you gonna tie this thing up? Uh oh. Hey, fish will give you a free crawdad if you come <laughs> off. Aaron, do what you need to do. Try to. I'm not moving. I'm, I'm, I'm still. <laughs> I'm gonna have to shoulder check your ass. Go for it. You better loosen that, that drag, oh. man. Dude, don't lose it, man. I can barely know you're all. I think he's all sitting way to bait. Don't, don't lose it. There we go. Oh, yes. Dude. Look at that. Choked. Don't you gone? I'm back. Let me keep it now. Apparently, the little one. <laughs> Hey, this is getting uh, pretty tight. We're tied up, two two. How are you feeling, Corey? Uh, I feel feeling all right. <laughs> you want to give him a kiss? Good. <laughs> <laughs> How you feeling? I got a smile now. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not too worried. I, I, I think. Uh, I think the momentum has shifted a little bit. What do you think, Coke? I think you need to shift your butt to the back of the boat. <laughs> Nails. Smiling again. After that devil up there, <laughs> you didn't look too thrilled. <laughs> dude, you know what you need to do, Corey, if you lost on your way in, dude, take Daniel with you. <laughs> Already planning on that. <laughs> Camera and all. Take him with you, dude. <laughs> dude, it's cold. I mean, I don't. I don't know. God, it's not a, a bongo. That's for sure. Dude, look at this fish. It's pretty, huh? Swallow. Dude, it's been a long time since I've gotten a bite. <laughs> Are you excited or what? I'm telling you, someone's gonna get a bite, but it's gonna be one pound that lives on this point. Got him! You got him. What did I tell you? <laughs> I think she's big, I don't know. Daniel, what do you think, man? Are you liking this? <laughs> so Daniel just misses one. Corey's hooked up. What do we got? We got mama. <laughs> oh, he reclaims the lead. I'm trying to get you guys to the juice. So we can bang on some. Juice is down here. Might be another choker. Uh oh. I felt the freaking pick. I'm like, what the heck? Daniel, you're slacking, man. You got that confidence going and it backfired. Oh. <laughs> 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 Oh, where'd he go? Yeah. Oh, God, that was a good bite. Yeah, I felt on slack. Nice. All right. There, he's 
He's starting to hurt you, man. All right, so it's four to two. He might be in trouble there, Daniel son. All right, so at lunch, I was not a happy camper. <laughs> I was nervous. I didn't even want to eat, really, even though I needed to. I felt pretty good. Yeah, Corey was feeling pretty good. I mean, usually fishing's fun and relaxing, but I was like in the game, so uh, I felt like I should probably have put maybe some laxative or something in his cup at lunch while he wasn't looking to help shift the momentum, but. Feeling pretty good, uh, up to nothing. And uh, you know, daylight was working against, so I figured catch a few more fish and put it in the bag. Let's uh, head back to the footage and see what happens. Moves rolling. It's on, Daniel. Lunch break is over on one. Dude, again! <laughs> and this guy, Dolly, goes before I count down, cuts both of us off. He yeah. hits problem. Yeah. He casts it in the, in, the, yeah. in the saddle. I know how to handle it. Yeah. <laughs> there he is. Big oh, ball. yeah, baby. Oh, that's a pretty good one. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that thing. Thick. Thick. Strike nice. King Jig. She gone. There we go, baby. Hey, Daniel. The sun's starting to set a little quicker and quicker. <laughs> Dude, they're all good ones out here, huh? Back to back on the jig. Hey, right. look, look at this thing. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't want the jig. He doesn't want it. You need to switch colors. Uh oh, not the Daniel Seven Hook. Oh god. <laughs> hey, <laughs> you still want to borrow the jig or what? <laughs> no. that, I learned that one from Bill Dance. <laughs> that way you can't use that footage. <laughs> hey, it's football season, man. Look at that thing. There, who wants it? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, baby. Dang, man. Hey, I'll, I'll offer it up again. I'll, I'll make one more cast on that side. <laughs> I'm about ready to take the jig. Probably more in there, yeah. Oh, yeah, but dude, this jig's got some mojo on it. <laughs> you want me to make it in a cast? Dude, there's a, there's a wall of them right there. Yeah, I'm going over right now. I'm Here, you take the troll motor. No, no time to be bashful. Here it is. First man to grab it gets it. I got plenty of jigs. We all want to throw it. <laughs> Dude, everyone's like, boom! Mm. All right, I'll rig them up. Oh, mother <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Dude, that's Dude, I'm gonna give you a jig and you blow. <laughs> That'll kill me. <laughs> we swore back in or something? No, I was just popping it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take a siesta. <laughs> I don't want it to change the, the fate for someone to swim. This is all big, dude. Oh. <laughs> this is all big. Oh. <laughs> that might be Bongo. Dude. Bongo! <laughs> Look at that, man. Okay, let me just reach my hand. <laughs> yeah, Corey. Let me just put my hand down there and get this jig back. God, this is juice. Are you even on rock right there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, 
dude. You know it's a big one when you have to retire line like four inches up because yeah. the teeth are that far up. How many was that? Like five in a row? Five grand or five ten? <laughs> here, I'm gonna go out here, Dad. Yeah. Doesn't matter where you throw. Where <laughs> the last time you caught one? <laughs> here, you wanna run it? Cody, since you're kind of putting us to task here, obviously again, we're doing something not correct or we're just not that good apparently. <laughs> but maybe you could inform us on, maybe fill us in on what, how we, should, what we need to be doing and what kind of rod and reel and your setup and everything. So right now we kind of, we're fishing some of the similar stuff, right? We're fishing some of this deep rock, but we switch it up to a little Strike King jig. What I'm throwing is a little half ounce peanut butter and jelly jig, football head jig, uh, with a little Strike King Rage chunk in the Falcon Lake Craw color. We're making that jig really compact and doing a couple things. You know, for one, when I'm feeling that rock, I'm making small little pops right over the rock. You know, I'm taking my rod tip and just slowly popping it right over the rock. Um, and it seems like we're getting some of these fish to react. As far as the rod, I'm throwing a 7.6 Tatula Elite rod by Daiwa. It's actually a flipping stick, but it's awesome rod for making super long casts of this jig. And the line, man, this is 15 pound line. 15 pound test, Seaguar Tatsu. This is fun. You know, when you get a bite, you don't have to be afraid on setting the hook. I mean, you can let them have it. So you guys uh, stick with it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll figure it out eventually, hopefully. Yeah. yeah. You know, on this reel too is a Daiwa Tatula SV TW. Got the SV spool, 7.3 gear ratio. So when you get a, a bite on a long cast, you can reel up to them and get them. But I'll tell you, so when you feel a fish go, donk. <laughs> That's a bite. <laughs> <laughs> That's what a bite feels like. Yeah. Okay. I haven't got that jig bite yet today, so. Oh, blast it? Probably. Oh, what happened? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that was a bride thrift hook set, man. Yeah, that's what Blast right there? That's <laughs> good. Just. Set it again. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Set it again. <laughs> Remember what you said earlier. Everyone wants to see Corey go in. Make it happen. <laughs> Uh oh. Uh oh. Corey. Up. <laughs> Big one? Eh? No. No? That's a giant, dude. <laughs> uh, been a while. There you go. Down by one. Right <laughs> There's a bass on that sucker. Oh no, dude. What's going on? <laughs> I'm, I'm back. Oh no, dude. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh! Oh, come off now! Give me the boat, come on! Oh, it's tied! Yes! <laughs> He's back! <laughs> you better hurry up and get back in there! <laughs> Should I start and stop this one? I did. Oh, it's gonna be a fish off, man. Dude, you, better, you better keep going. Corey's about to bust one right here. Dude, you've been tied before. Corey might catch the next two. Daniel's got a smile again, man. Yeah, I'm back in it. It's coming down to the wire. I was literally about to say, like, before that, all right, Daniel, when do you want to jump in? <laughs> We're in the fourth quarter. Okay, it's 3.22. I mean, in another 30 minutes, that sound's gone. But I mean, no one can give up now. Okay, how about it's 3.32. How about after four, it's sudden death, and you can knock the other guy's fish off. <laughs> you get one swipe at the fish. <laughs> Here's the thing, you come anywhere near my rod, yeah. you're taking the dip early. <laughs>
<laughs> you guys tense right now or what? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Dude, double fishing? <laughs> I got my two pole stamp. Oh, God. Thought I felt victory. <laughs> Dude, whoever, whoever sets the hook next, the other guy's gonna sh man. <laughs> Dude, I know Corey's serious because he hasn't spoke or farted in like 30 minutes. <laughs> oh, I think that's the cast right there. I don't know why I got the giggle so bad. What do you think, Corey? Dude, you could go to Nursery Point. Oh, <laughs> oh. Come off! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> How much time we got left, though? Like 20 minutes? Are we going to 4.30? That may be the winner of right course. there. Yeah, it's 3.41. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, dude, it's five to four, man. Oh, God. Well, dude, 30 minutes ago, I was I was gonna ask you if you should just jump in now, dude. Corey. Yes. You wanna go to the other spot and end it out? I think so, yeah. Okay. It's 358.50. You got to 450. Daniel, get up there, man. Daniel's sticking with the jig. Corey's got the Ocho. Dude, I want Corey to tie it up, man. If I could see sudden death. <laughs> it's a defense mechanism. Yeah, for sure. It's like a stink bug. <laughs> <laughs> what, we got five minutes? Minute 45 seconds. Minute 40. He's falling apart. <laughs> oh, no. Apparently they're still over there. <laughs> yeah, but this would have done it. I yeah, bombed it way out there. <laughs> what? What time is it? Oh. <laughs> I, I, the cast is still out. All right, all right, right, you, get, all right you get the you cast. You get to work the cast in. Oh. Are you serious? <laughs> I was just over there. <laughs> <laughs> what the f <laughs> These cheap reels, I don't know. <laughs> He's just gonna troll all the way back to the ramp with that thing. Unfortunately, Daniel's dying because he reeled in. <laughs> He's gonna do this for an hour. <laughs> oh, my mouth hurts from smiling, man. I'll get a photo of you guys. Let's get a photo. Let's let your rod drag, Corey. Let it drag so we can go to sudden death. All right. Where's up and <laughs> Oh, all right, here we go. It is literally freezing outside. Corey lost the bet. He won He won the biggest fish, okay? So you do get a reel. You get yeah, a tattoo at 150, but we went to lunch. Corey was up four to two and Daniel was down in the dumps for sure. So. Afterwards, we come back, he catches two fish in a minute and a half. He caught the final fish. So the total count was five for Daniel, four for Corey. So Corey's gotta jump in the lake. And let me remind you, it is 51 degree water temp. It is colder than the ocean. And he's going in the water. Probably 50 degrees right there. Corey, right. how you feeling, man? Cold. <laughs> I'm not wet yet and I'm still cold. Three. Two, I'm going one. <laughs> Woo! Feels great. 51 degree water temp. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? That's how it went down. 
First bingo, bango, bongo. Corey, you earned this. It's big a sweet, fish, baby. sweet reel right yeah. there. Yeah, and you got to catch a big fish, which is fun in itself too. So congratulations to you for that. Cody, you kicked our butts. <laughs> Um, but we'll be coming back for some more. And then, yeah, man, that was fun seeing you jump in that water, even though you didn't really seem like too bothered by it. I mean, so surprisingly, like, I don't know if I was in shock or what, but I did not feel that bad. Maybe it's my uh, extra layers of insulation that helped me out for that, but uh, it, it didn't feel as bad as I thought it would. Uh, towards the end there, I kind of was thawing out after we kind of had gotten changed some warm clothes, but it really wasn't that bad. Uh, I'll take that if I get the reel, no problem, anytime. There you go. So we'll be doing some more of these. Um, you know, let us know if you guys enjoyed that. And I uh, think we got a couple things to give away. So on Facebook, uh, like, share, and tag a friend for your chance to win this week's gear giveaway. Thanks, guys. Take it easy.